So today I'm going to be unboxing kind of a cool product from G-Skill. This is their Eco Series RAM and I realize yeah it's more unboxing RAM and there's not a whole lot to talk about about RAM but what I want you to note about this packaging is that they've gone and they've colored it green. Now green is a common theme out there right now for computer parts. People are bringing down, people are demanding parts with lower power consumption while still demanding higher performance in general. So the Eco Kit that we're looking at today, what makes this kit green is the fact that it actually uses very, very low voltages to achieve its operating speed. So this particular kit that I'm looking at right here is actually a DDR3 1600 megahertz kit. So it's a reasonable speed, cast latency of seven. That's fairly good as well. But what's really exceptional about it is it runs at 1.35 volts. Even a few months ago, a stick like this would have definitely been running at 1.65 because the binning just wasn't that good yet for DDR3 modules. Now you can have a look at the heat spreader here. It's a fairly bog standard heat spreader. You got your G-Skill logo here. You got kind of a cool, uh, you know, bladey, wavy sort of design. The top has little ventilation holes. You can see our Oh yeah, no, it's applied properly. Yeah, yeah. It just hooks in at either end and then there's little holes. So it's a dual channel kit. That means that it is optimized for uh, Sorry, I'm still in like my gym strip here. Uh, you, so that means it is optimized for the Core i5, Core i7, LGA 1156 platform. And the reason that G-Skill's been working so hard to drive down voltage, first with an update to the Ripjaw series, and then with this new Eco series, is that the Core i5 and Core i7 CPUs with their integrated memory controller will actually last much longer the lower the memory voltage you use. So thank you for checking out my unboxing and product overview of the G-Skill Eco Series RAM.